Welcome back guys to the episode number three. Today we are going to review Give Me The Wine. The Chateau again? No, it's not me. I haven't touched it. Then who? No, it's not him. I just remember. I've been on a wine-oriented lunch where we had this bottle with one of the best sommeliers of Lisbon and I'll tell you their review in a short second. Chateau Christi, it's an impressive property with about 500 hectares. They started more or less recently with that project uh, from 2015 while the family gets back to 1882. Soon we'll get a chance to admire the beautiful chateau and I can assure you guys, the winemaker and owner are getting big invests into this project. Today we will review a 100% Chardonnay barrel fermented and barrel aged for a few months with batonnage. The vintage is 2018 and as I told you before, in Moldova, we work very well with both native grapes and international grape varietals. Especially, we'll get the big focus on French origin grapes when talking about the winemaking technique in Moldova. So as you can see, the bottle was consumed at that wine lunch. At that lunch we had one of the best sommeliers from Lisbon and one of the opinions the bottle was tasted blindly that's the most important that was the meaning and at that blind tasting one of the sommeliers that is the head one in a restaurant with two stars Michelin said this wine for me could be a high quality Chablis because I'm feeling here the high quality Chardonnay grape worked perfectly. But of course, Chablis is Chablis and New Zealand is New Zealand and Chile is Chile. Here we have Moldova. And we need to know that always we have unique wines in every part of the world, the same way as we do it in Moldova. Despite the fact that this is an international grape varietal, of course we'll have a unique wine because we talk about the terroir, we talk about the passion from the winemaker and we talk about the climate and how the grape is worked. On the nose, the wine is clean and denotes that minerality, that pure fruit of high quality. We talk about star fruit, we talk about quinces, we talk about yellow tree fruits, stone fruits, and I would say minerality again. And actually you can feel already on the nose this buttery. And on the mouth, we have exactly the same sensation. We have the direct link we all, with all these aromas we had on the nose, we feel that on the mouth. We also feel a high acidity that is so good with this buttery body. The acidity will go very well. We have a very long aftertaste. And yes, by the, by the end, on final, we can say that this is a high quality Chardonnay wine made in Moldova. Cheers and drink only good wines.